Yeah, well, I think what you said in the introduction really sums it up, which is that she was haunted by the face of her baby. And that's really what is at stake. We have two victims here. We have a woman who was a victim of B-Pass's Pills by Post scheme, where they sent her the abortion pills while she was eight months pregnant so that she could abort her baby in eight months pregnant. Although and we've, got we to have... say, we've got to say they didn't know. She had apparently misled the nurse sure. to believing that she was not as advanced in her pregnancy. Yeah, that's that's absolutely correct. But, you know, you really should be checking. You should be doing an ultrasound or else things like this are going to happen. We warned that things like this would happen. We said it's obvious that things like this will happen. They said, oh, don't worry, you're just scaremongering. They did it. And this is what happened. So we were really vindicated and proven right. Carla became the victim of that as did her baby. And as we said, you know, in the introduction, no one was denying this was a baby. This was an eight month long pregnancy. Mm -hmm. This was a baby who was killed as a result of that sort of um, careless work by BPAS. And what really frightens me as a medical professional is that people are now lobbying for that law to be even more liberalized so that it would be legal for a doctor to kill a baby at eight months of pregnancy. And I think like the majority of the people in this country, that that is just absolutely insane and abhorrent and it clearly shouldn't but, but, be the case for it to be legal.